feel really like emotional i feel like i'm just lonely i feel like i'm battling stuff um that i can't like control you know i cry for you you know i die for you you know i ride for you big dirty slide for you love you forever baby that's all i'm trying to do love you forever baby that's all i'm trying to do love you i do if i didn't have you then i lose real learning some homies yeah you're my boo and there's nothing in this world i want to What's up, NJ gang? Get on high go. It's your girl Jayla, and I'm back with another video. You guys, honestly, um, this video is just gonna be straightforward. I'm gonna keep it real with you guys. Um, and I'm gonna just let you guys know what's been going on like behind cameras because honestly, like I'm to the point where I'm like at a um emotional like breakdown. Um I don't know if it's because it's been super rainy here and like we have like a tropical storm and um I don't know if it's because like quarantine I don't I just don't know what's going on with me I haven't been feeling myself lately honestly um I feel like a lot of stuff I'm just going through right now and I I feel like it's unbearable really um so I just lost like a cousin and stuff and um, me and Nair haven't been in the best, like the best way. Like I feel like this is like the worst that we done got. Um, and I always thought like during quarantine, I thought we would like be closer, but honestly it drove us apart. Um, I don't know if it's because we like you know been around each other for too long and you know relationships need breaks or whatever but like obviously you guys see that we haven't uploaded in a week the last time um he surprised me with the car it was very unexpected obviously you guys see that i cried because i really liked that car and that was like one of my that was my biggest dream car i said if i didn't get the range rover i get the tesla and he made that happen for me it was very unexpected like that was my raw real reaction i was just speechless i didn't know what to say i love it you love it baby yeah. <laughs> i love you baby <laughs> i love you baby when did you get this don't worry about it you know what i said don't worry about it, baby just enjoy your whip baby you hear me let's enjoy it baby Go ahead, oh sit in there, sit in there, babe. I'm like shaking, sh I'm nervous. <laughs> you look so pretty in here, baby. I ain't gonna lie, this is you, baby. This is not you it's right here, baby. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Um, I got emotional and everything. But then after, you know, after I got the car and stuff, we had gotten to like a disagreement. I wouldn't say an argument, but like a disagreement, whatever. And... Um, we talked, I mean, sometimes I could be stubborn, like not talk. Sometimes he could be stubborn and not want to talk, but I wouldn't like say it was his fault or it was my fault, but we just got into a disagreement and we decided like, we're going to, you know, just separate. Um, you guys, it was hard for me, like the first three days I got emotional I'm trying not to get emotional right now um he said he was going to leave and like I was looking on the computer and stuff and I seen that he was like searching for apartments and everything and he said he was just gonna like let me stay here but this house is like too big for me honestly um nayer has gone he's in LA he said that he was moving there and I'm just here. Um, my friend came here to comfort me. She's here for a while from Cincinnati. And I've just been trying to keep my mind off things. I didn't want to 
um, just like leave you guys um, thinking because I feel like you guys deserve to know like we share everything with you guys so I wanted you guys to know um, obviously you guys see that we have an upload for almost a whole week if you guys see on my Instagram both of our pictures are gone um, we just been going through it um, I just feel like was best for us like we've been together for seven years and i feel like we need a you know a break or something i just feel like was meant will be like will be there like i don't know i've just been trying to keep my mind off of things um i had like a couple drinks just to you know keep me happy and stuff trying to like get dressed up because literally like the last time we uploaded was the only time that the last time I got actual dressed and um felt good and stuff I went to go get my hair done and I was just you know trying to be like just find myself figure out what I really want I don't know what I have planned for the future I don't know if we're going to upload after this. Obviously, he's going to speak when he wants to speak. But me, this is going to be, you know, my last. I'm just giving you guys an update on stuff, what's been going on. Um, so, yeah, I went to the mall today. And I got, like, a few things because, you know, shopping makes us girls happy. You guys know that when we um when we feel sad or when we feel down or something we go shop well at least me so i want to go get like some candles just like for like a positive vibe and just keep my mind off things stuff um nayir did ask about cali he asked about Cali. He said he was going to take Cali. But I totally disagree with that. Um, I don't think that that's fair. I don't think that's fair that he takes her. I feel like I should be the one to have her. Because I feel like I can comfort her better. Um, and especially when we're like living in different states. I don't think that that would be the best choice to do. Um, but I don't know you guys I just really didn't want to like talk about this but I just a lot of people in my DMs are asking like when we're going to upload um why haven't we post a lot of people notice that we don't have each other pictures on Instagram anymore so I just feel like you guys know we never like really be in into like into like exposing our business but I feel like this is not exposing I just feel like every relationship go through things and I just wanted to show you guys that we aren't the perfect couple we do go through things behind like the camera stuff people just don't know about um we do have our own problems when the more money you get the more problems it is but I never thought that like during quarantine it will drive us apart I thought it will bring us like together and it's just so much going in the world that I just really can't take everything I don't know if it's like in the air um I don't know if it's in the air and it's just making me go crazy I don't know but I feel really like emotional I feel like I'm just lonely. I feel like I'm battling stuff um, that I can't like control. Um, so I just wanted to come here to let all my emotions out. Um, I'm glad I have like my friend here. I'm glad I have like my friend here to, um, you know, comfort me in Cali, of course. But um, I'm not asking Nayir to speak on anything. Um, if he doesn't want to, I'm not forcing him. Um, I just wanted you guys to 
see my part my view um and just let you guys know that i'm not okay i hope i'll be okay i just want closure from us i never wanted to have a breakup to where it's like a toxic breakup if you guys know what i'm saying um but i don't know i'm just gonna try to be the best i can be and just um find myself if it comes back it will come back i think you guys should um go reach out to Nair, make sure he's okay. Um, we have each other blocked, like numbers blocked and stuff. But I just hope everything will be fine for me. Um, there's no bad blood. I don't feel hatred towards him. I love Nair, like we did, like we came up together. So I feel like that's like, that's my love. I really don't want him to go anywhere. But, you know, everybody gets to a point where they just have to. We have, we literally was just doing good. I promise you guys. We literally was just doing good. We haven't argued for like two months straight. Like we was doing so good. And then this will happen. So I think this just ticked it off like. If it's not one thing, it's another. And I just feel really bad. Um, I wish I could talk to him. Can you guys please go spam him in the in his DM and tell him to unblock my n number and just talk to me. Um, I don't know, you guys. Um, I don't know. I'm just going to um, end out this video because... I feel like the more I talk about it, the more I get emotional. And I'm not trying to get that way. He's moved on. I'm moving on. And hopefully, in the long run, if we decide to come back and be together, that's what it is. But until then, we're just not working. And... I just wish the best for him. Now, if you're watching this, I love you. Um, I wish the best for you. I never wanted to end off like this because I feel like it's never closure. I feel like we still have words to say to each other. But um, I don't know. Just text me whenever you get a chance, whenever you feel like you want to talk. Just text me. My number will still be the same, and I love you. And to all of our supporters, I love you guys. Thank you, thank you guys for, um, you know, just uh, supporting us and um, just keeping up with us and subscribing to us. If you guys want to see more videos from me, you guys can go to the NJ Family Channel because I'm going to be posting on there and. Um, me and I is going to be even with the channels, um, whatever, and come, come to the channels. We split evenly, and we just, you know, work from a distance, love from a distance, and have a relationship from a, dis, a, dis, a distance. But um, I don't know. Hopefully, everything changes. But I love you guys, and... Um, you guys can catch me on the NJ Family channel. Peace out. One plus one, that's you and me. You perfect, you perfect. You look good, baby. You a queen, you worth it. You deserve it, yeah. I'ma put away my phone, baby. Tryna get you out the slums, put you on, baby. I'ma take you to the mall, what you want, baby. Tryna get you out them G 